Top 10 Expensive Dogs in the World Before we start a video please subscribe our channel and press the bell icon for regular updates and you can also give suggestion at comment section. The number 10 is Irish Wolfhound The Irish Wolfhound is a breed of domestic dog, specifically a very large sighthound from Ireland. The name originates from its purpose, wolf hunting with dogs, rather than from its appearance. Irish Wolfhounds are known for their athletic ability, especially in endurance running. And of course, there is an Irish proverb to describe their personality. A food a day. While no one disputes the Irish Wolfhound's size, this striking dog's aura. The number 9 is Akita. Akita one of the most popular expensive dog breeds are strong and dominant and can be aggressive towards other dogs if not properly trained. Akitas also tend to act like felines, they like to clean themselves after eating and may even clean up their owners. The price range on Akitas can vary. The number 8 is Saluki. Saluki the royal dog of Egypt, is one of the oldest known breeds of domesticated dogs. Once used by hunters to track and bring down gazelles, they have an independent mind and may require a heavy hand when it comes to training. The cost of a Saluki puppy will vary depending on the breeder, whether the dog is male or female. The number 7 is Pharaoh Hound. Don't let the name fool you on this one. The Pharaoh Hound is not an Egyptian dog breed. In fact, it is the national dog of Malta. The Pharaoh Hound has a royal look with an athletic disposition. They are highly intelligent, independent and rare, which, of course, makes them expensive. The coat is short and glossy, ranging from rich tan to chestnut with white markings. One of the most distinct traits of the pharaoh hound is his amber... The number six is Tibetan Mastiff. The Tibetan Mastiff, one of the largest dogs in the world, is an ancient breed indigenous to Nepal and China. Tibetan Mastiffs are known to be territorial and strong-willed, and they need to be trained and socialized. Just like pandas, purebred Tibetan Mastiffs are extremely rare, so their price tag is high. In 2013, a rare Tibetan Mastiff sold for $1.9 million in China. The number 5 is Rottweilers. Rottweilers were originally bred as pulling dogs. They are fearless, territorial and protective of their owners. It is important to start socialization at an early age, even though Rottweilers are generally good-natured and placid and they are great family pets. Of ancient Roman Grover dogs, a massive type dog that was a dependable, rugged dog with great intelligence and guarding instincts. The breed got its name from a region in Germany. The number four is Lao Chen. The Lao Chen, which means little lion in German, looks similar to popular toy breeds like the Maltese. Although they may look like some common breeds, Lao Chen are very difficult to find. Only a few hundred Lao Chen puppies are registered at official kennel clubs around the world each year, and their rarity makes them expensive. Just be prepared to give your Lao Chen a good brush at least twice a week, or have it clipped short. Twice the number three is Chow Chow. This Chinese breed is one of the oldest dog breeds existing today, and they used to be good at herding, hunting, guarding, and pulling. Now they are good companions, coming in multiple colors, including red, black, blue, cinnamon, and cream. And they have a unique black tongue. Purebred puppies can cost up to $8,500. The number 2 is English Bulldog. English Bulldogs are known for their silly personalities, which make them widely popular. Not only does this breed cost a lot initially, they continue to cost a lot due to medical issues. 
Due to size discrepancies between the sexes, these little dogs are usually bred using artificial insemination, and this can get pricey. There's a certain skill to walk. The number one is Samoyed. Samoyed dogs are tough, strong and competitive, thanks to their origins as reindeer herders. They have an adorably alert expression and a friendly predisposition that makes them good family dogs. Samoids are hard to breed so they're not very common, and you can expect to pay a little, or a lot, more for one. Okay, paw. Yeah. Speak. Oh. Yeah. Leave it. Leave it. Look at me. Okay. Yeah.